When you do get a divorce, there are some differences regarding what is going to be listed in the bankruptcy schedules and what isn't. Uh, for example, in Texas, there's a thing called community property. So we have assets that are community property, and there also can be community property debt. And there can be separate debt as well. So in order to determine this, we have to do a, an interview with you in our office and determine whose name is set up on the account as the primary debtor. Is there any joint debtors? Uh, and there's a difference between being a co-debtor on a, on a bill and being someone who's an authorized signer, as well as what were the proceeds used for for the purchase. If they were used for the household um, income and the household expenses, that can be something that we'll have to consider. So in short, it's a case-by-case -case, um, analysis, but it is possible for one spouse to file bankruptcy and list debt just associated with that spouse, and the other spouse will not have to list any of their debt if it is truly separate debt.